Welcome back guys to the Minecraft Military Force. Today we're going to be building the General Dynamics F-16 Fighting Falcon. And this is a multi-role air superiority fighter used by the US Air Force along with many other countries around the world. And these were manufactured by General Dynamics originally, uh, but Lockheed Martin, they bought them out and now they produce them since 1993. Over 4,600 of these were delivered and uh, there are many different variants of them and they have different block numbers to denote upgrades, but I have no idea about that. So I just based this on like a F-16C and it's using this dark gray and light gray livery. Uh, we also have this uh, cockpit canopy window pillar here. That's a new addition because we are upgrading it from our old Mikael Pacos F-16 right over here. So you can see the difference between two. It was back in 2018, so we badly needed an upgrade design. And also shout out to the Minecraft Military Force for helping me out, uh, especially on like Discord, Omega, and Martecha, and a lot of four. Give them good feedback because if I had just left it alone by myself, uh, it wouldn't be as good as this, you know. So yeah, let's go take a closer look at the design of this. So again, this is using this dark gray, light gray livery. While the other one is kind of like a plain gray. So um, this is what I primarily see. Although depending on the weather conditions, this may look a little lighter. Uh, but I believe they're all painted like this. We have the air fuel intake down underneath. It's a very characteristic. And this one is with the landing gear. Actually you have a flying one over there. We'll take a look at it later. We got the skinny wings here. We got the external fuel drop tanks for extended range. And we got some missile here. And there also is a wing tipped uh, hard point as well. And then right here in the back, we got the rear of the engine here. We got this gray band on this vertical stabilizer. This you can actually change the color of. Um, in real life, it's a little bit taller right here, but you know, it's Minecraft. <laughs> what can you do? We also got some stabilizer fins down here as well. Uh, the landing gear, which I actually didn't realize it, but the F-16 landing gear, it's actually combined into like one thing here in the middle. It's not really like separate hatches. It's like one big one. <laughs> I did not know that. So now I could show you what it looks like if it's in the air with the landing gear all retracted, all the doors put inside. Here's what it looks like. Very nice. And you can also, you know, customize this if you want. You know, there's different loadouts you can put. You could put another uh, fuel tank underneath the belly, make it really heavy. Um, but yeah, that's uh, pretty much it for the build. You can definitely use it for many countries in the world. It's used by like Belgium, Denmark, Egypt, Greece, Indonesia, Iraq, Israel, Jordan, Morocco, Netherlands, Oman, Pakistan, Poland, Portugal, Romania, Singapore, South Korea, you know, Thailand, Turkey, etc. Many countries. Definitely, if you're not from the US, you can still build this for your Air Force. But yeah, if you guys enjoy the F-16 and you want to see more fighter jets like this, which I will be posting in the future, make sure you hit that like button down below and comment telling which fighter you guys want to see next. If you are interested in making military builds for yourself, also check out our Minecraft Military Force Discord in link in the description. But anyways, let's get started on the F-16. So first off, we're going to grab some materials. So we're going to take out a grindstone wheel, a birch fence, fence gate, black concrete, stone brick stairs, and slab, and a site slab, and a site block, and then an iron trap door. All right, so first off, I'll be building it where the landing gear is in the front. So I'm going to place down this birch fence two blocks above the ground like this. Then underneath, we're going to add in a grindstone wheel or landing gear. Ideally, this wheel would be black in color, but yo, it's Minecraft. Uh, after this, we're going to add in a birch fence gate right behind it like that. And then a black concrete right on top. And then a stone brick slab right here. Another slab spaced apart on top. And then stone brick stairs upside down to the side of it. And we're going to make this 11 blocks long. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. And then we'll add in a stone brick slab. All right, so let's go back over here. And we're going to add in four andesite slabs. 1, 2, 3, 4. And then four andesite blocks on top. You know, I think we'll add in another andesite right after it. 
Then we'll add in an andesite slab right here to the side. And then we'll add in an iron trap door, one here, then three down here. At the tip, we'll add in a stone brick slab, two blocks uh, long like this, stone brick slab right here as well. And then at the tip, there's going to be this dark oak tra trap door and then a daylight detector. We're going to make that blue. All right, so next we're going to skip a block here, add in a polished black stone brick slab, and then three black concretes. So it's going to be one, two, three, and then facing the back, a polished black stone brick stairs, and then a cobbled deep slate slab, a dark oak trap door, another trap door right on top. Next up, we're going to add in cobbled deep slate stairs right here. Skip a block, add in another one, and I'm going to make this one 12 blocks long. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Then right over here, we'll add in a stone brick stairs like that. All right, then we'll go to the back and we'll add in a black uh, wall to the side of that. And in front, we'll add in a dark oak fence gate, open that up. And then polish black stone brick wall next to it and polished blackstone brick slab on top and below it. All right, next up, we'll add in andesite blocks. We're gonna make two by two right here, an andesite stairs in front, and then we'll add in two more andesite blocks here, andesite stairs and slab. Then on top of this, we'll add in this deep slate brick stairs and then two gray concretes. On top, we'll add an andesite block here, andesite stairs in front, and andesite walls. Two of them like that. Then we'll go down here, we'll add in cyan terracotta, and fill in this gap. Then we'll add in a lever facing towards the back, followed by a gray carpet, and then a stone pressure plate. And I made a little mistake here, this is actually shifted one block back, so I move this dark oak trap door here. And we'll place a daylight detector right there. We're going to make that blue, just like that. Then we're going to add in a stone bun. There's going to be one in the front here. And then another one uh, right underneath the stairs. And then another two to the side of that. And also add in a black stone bun to the side of that. All right, next, let's go to the back here. We'll add in a stone brick slab here. And then five stone blocks, so one two, three, four, five, just like that. And then we'll add in two polished deep slate blocks. And then we'll add in stone for the rest all the way across to the very front like that. And then we'll actually change this block here into a stone brick slab. Add another stone brick slab underneath here. And I'm gonna make it three blocks long. So one, two, three. Then we'll skip a block, add in a birch fence gate. Birch fence to the side end rod here in the middle, and another birch fence gate here. Then diagonally out, we'll add in a black wool. We're going to add a lever so it connects with the landing gear. And the outside portion, we'll add in a stone button. Then we're going to add in a stone brick slab here, and then two iron trap doors. To the side, we'll add in inner site walls. They're going to be um, two blocks wide right there to the side of that. And then we'll go to the side um, right above uh, the wheel. We'll add in three of these spruce fence gates and we're going to open up the outer ones up like that. Next up in the back, we'll add in cobbled deep slate slab. And we are going to add in four here. So like that. Go daily down. And add in three, then add in two right there in the back. All right, we're doing good so far. Keep it up. So we need to make that window um, pillar. So go to the loom, add a black banner with light gray dye, make a diagonal, back and side, and light gray dye on the bottom half of this. That's it. You just put this right towards the back of the window cockpit like that. Very cool. All right, now let's work on the wings. So first we're gonna take out an iron trap door. We're gonna go line up where the stone brick stairs is, add one here. 
And we're gonna make it eight blocks long. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, like that. Then we're gonna to go to the back and add in andesite stairs. And we wanna actually add it so it's right side up. And we're gonna make this so five blocks long and it's gonna be cornered at the end. So one, two, three, four, corner it like that. All right, next up, we'll add in another iron trap door here. It's gonna go right towards the back. <laughs> My plugin makes it open. And we're gonna make it five blocks long. So one, two, three, four, five, like that. All right, then we'll go here, skip a block and add in two blocks wide and a site uh, walls like that. And then we'll add in three and iron trap doors like that. Then we're gonna add in four iron trap doors here and add another one at the tip of this. Then we'll add in another um, iron trap door, one right here, another one underneath, another one towards the front. And then we'll add another three trap doors here and then a redstone comparator. Gonna be the fins. All right, so next up we'll go right here and we'll take out a smooth stone slab. Gonna add one in the front, add one underneath and then two iron trap doors top each other. And then smooth stone slab going all the way across to the back here. Then the back we'll add in two iron trap doors on top of each other like that. All right, so next up we need to cover up the wings. So uh, that's gonna be gray carpet. So just cover up these iron trap doors here. And then we'll leave this wing tip alone because that's gonna be the where the missile is. The wing tip missile. So try to make um, this pattern here. So it should be like a diagonal going across like that. All right, so once you do that, we're gonna copy everything that we did on this side and build the other half. All right, so once you have both halves, it should look like this. Then we need to add in an iconic detail that's on like almost every military aircraft I see. You know, that US Air Force roundel. So we're gonna place that light gray carpet right here in the corner here, just on this wing. And yeah, I believe that's pretty much it on how to build the F-16 Fighting Falcon fighter jet in Minecraft. Hope you guys enjoy the video. If you do, make sure you hit that like button down below. Subscribe if you had already. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.